Hey, what's up guys, Dude Tech here. Welcome back with a brand new video. In this video, I have another cool tweaks for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy today's video. With that being said, let's get started. Okay, so the first week for today's video, I'm going to be talking about the newest app center for your iOS jailbroken device. So this is will allow you to have another application or another folder on your control center. So if you swap here, you will be find the app center here. So easily you can launch any application from here so you can do your search here and then for example you want to open a camera so easily you can just up on the camera and then the option will be launch your camera from here so if you just swap back you it will be taking you back to the up center so if you want to run uh the cdf for example from here it will be allow you to open most the applications uh, from here and easily when if you want to get back it will be taking you to the last thing that you open which is going to be the application your camera whatever it is going to be as you guys can see i want to get back to the same page that i came from it will take me to the same page if i swoop again it will take me back to the app center and easily i can just close those pages from here and then take a look again for any other application that i want to run easily from here so if we go to the settings here for the app center you guys are going to be seeing just two things the first thing you need to just enable the app from here and then the other thing that it just the you can just organize the way of the uh, image or the picture that when you launch your application from here the app center finger touch so is this tweak here once you download it it will give you more than option using your fingerprint here so the, when you download the tweak you need to just enable the button here and then if you want to launch one of these options here which is going to be the vibrate if you want to use the vibrate once you launch the application it's going to be up to you and then here the status for your vibration if you want to set it so here is most of the actions that you can you can organize or you can just put it the way you like but for me i just keep it on default so let's just go through all those actions here so the first thing that one touch is going to be home so if i as you guys can see if i just touch it one it is going to be taking me to my home screen so if i double touch it here it will take me to the switcher and then from there i can just switch to another application or go back to the same page that i came from if i just hold it it will be close my phone and in the triple uh touch which is one two three is going to be as you guys can tell from the back here that i open my flashlight here so if i do give it again a triple touch which is one two three is going to be kill my flashlight here finger touch translucent messages so once you download the tweak you have two things to configure on your iDevice the first one which is going to be to enable the bond here and then the other thing if you want to enable the blur wallpaper here let me just show you guys what I'm talking about here right now so if I go to the messages here right now so if we go to the messages you guys can see right now what is the difference in between the both the old and right now so it's going to be give your wallpaper that fade in the back there you guys can see right now how it was beautiful and nice looking and then even if I want to open my notification so if I will open notification it will be giving me the same option so let me just cancel one of the notifications here you guys can see how is that looks like right now so it's give your notification center here real nice and that fade is beautiful on your eye device okay so sometimes we like to play with our icons or playing with our apps icon here and then we want to just set it the way that we like so if i tap and hold here right now and put that here and then just bring that here and then this is the way that i like it i mean i just want to play with my eye device the way i like so this is if you want to do that you need to download the anger so this is the tweak here once you download the tweak you have two things to configure which is the first one to enable the bond and then you can choose the length scape of your layout so you can put that on or you can just disable that so once you finish everything you need to just respring your device so if i want to bring everything here if i want to bring everything here just like so just like so 
you know so i can right now anger it's allowed me to do anything on my screen i can put my things or my icons the way i like using my iDevice anger let me talk right now about the excited tweak for today's video which is going to be the analog so once you download the tweak before i'm going to be go through all those configures let me just go back so you guys saw me when i close any from those applications it would give me like some bouncing and then sound effect just like so you guys see that so if i just go back to my screen same thing and then even you can change this so let me just go back right now talking about the analogue and the first thing that you need to do is just enable the bond here and then you can go to the animations here and then you can set the way or the fast as you like for your bounce okay and then even you can go to the app here and then you can choose the app that you want to launch it so it's going to be do that effect when you just launch that app here this is the sound so it's going to be giving you more than sound if i tap on sound here it will give you so much ton that's a lot here you can set the sound effect for uh, your icon the way you like so once you finish and if you want to try the sound you can just give it a taste here just like so i set this one here so if i go back right now and then talking about the uh, other part which is going to be the animate on launch if you want to turn that on the animate on close so i set it on when i open it it will give me that animate and then when I, once i close the application was giving me uh the same animate or i can set it on in a different uh action and uh when i touch it same thing when you shake your device when you on a swipe okay so let me just go back right now and taking you and just giving you guys a little bit information about the animation here so if you go and then let me just stop on the animation here it will giving you more than effect for your icon so when you launch your icon when you launch your application it will you can set it the way you like so you guys can see it's giving me that fade there and then if i launch it again go to the animation and i want to go that is the uh the run one it's really beautiful and i like it if you guys want to set it so if i put the run here and then go back take a look this is more just think about the tweak when i highly recommend you guys to download it because you're going to be have fun a lot with it you're going to be set some things on your i device which is going to be give your friends really shocked when they see that on your i device and a launch i hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you like the video please just like always give it a big thumbs up subscribe for my channel for more videos i see you guys in next video this is do tech thanks for watching